Okay, so this is the uh, our final frame for the back portion. Um, this is where the sh uh, part of the shoulder is going to attach. It's going to have a piston that goes from this point to here, and then there'll be a metal bar that sort of is a kind of an L shape from here to there, and then that'll attach to the rest of the arm. Um, over here is basically where the hip actuation is going to attach. So it's from the same point as where the shoulder piston attaches, except from here it goes to your femur. We now use force sensors for detecting user movement, and we have a new board layout that reflects this change. It can communicate to a master control Arduino that um, will send diagnostic information to the laptop. Here, no, no, down a little bit. Uh, a little bit more. Okay, so this is one of our um, control uh, options that we're doing, and this is a three-axis joystick. Um, and what I've done is I've essentially made uh, this, all this white here is 3D printed. Um, and I 3D printed a space where this slides in, and then you just screw it in. Um, and the idea is, is that you would push forward and backwards, and that would move uh, where the elbow would be. That would move this back and forth, and then up and down would actually move this up and down. So once I get that hooked up, we'll actually be able to see um, how effective that is. For mounting the cylinders, we have to keep them all roughly similar. So to do that, because we don't want to mess up, we have made a template, and we're using that to build uh, a lot of similar mounting points for the cylinders. Oh, look at that.